Ipswich is an area with a high Indigenous population but little representation of their culture. But that's changing, with the city's first Indigenous art and cultural centre now open. Annie Clark has been painting since the age of eight, but the Ipswich artist has only recently found the support to hold exhibitions and wished she had Indigenous art mentors growing up. It would have grounded me. It would have given me um, a better perspective and a better pathway. She's now creating a place for Indigenous people to share their culture in one of Ipswich's most well-known buildings. And I think a space like this gives a chance for the wider community to come and learn about Indigenous culture and it also gives the Indigenous community a chance to showcase who they are and teach about their culture, their way. The former Collier's restaurant was owned by Ipswich Mayor Paul Pizzali and has been relocated and restored by an employment training company which works with many Indigenous people. I wanted the restaurant to have not only a lease of life but something that's going to contribute to our city in Australia. It brings in diversity, you know, it gives us a new approach to um, and access to the, to the community that we're here to support. The centre's been officially opened and Annie Clark wants it to host a broad range of workshops. But she needs to raise $45,000 to complete the project. I think it'll make a huge difference. Um, there's been such a positive feedback from the amount of people that um, have heard about this that they can't wait to see it happen. It just needs a finishing touch to complete the picture. Eric Torchek, ABC News, Ipswich.